Citizens of the Republic, welcome back to another reaction slash review. Today, we're back with the Bad Batch Season 3, Episode 12. Uh, you know, back here with some more Bad Batch every week. I look forward to this. It's a great, great series. Just gets better by the weeks, man. I mean, it's it definitely is up there rivaling uh, Clone Wars, you know, their last season. Um, and honestly, I might like this better. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm just talking about it strictly, but yeah, no, it's it's great. It's a great season. I don't really have much to say going into this, just that I've been enjoying it. Honestly, what about you, Luke? Um, I mean, I'm with you that I've been thoroughly enjoying it. Uh, but at the same time, I like. I want to say I like it more than Clone Wars. I think it's close though. It, 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 that's the thing it's very they're, they're two completely different shows like clone wars is an anthology it, it can't focus on those specific characters as much because there's so much oh yeah uh yeah. whereas bad batch can really focus in on on the characters that we have and uh it's the character development is amazing uh so i don't know it, it's two different things so it's very hard to to really compare them but I don't know. I've really been liking Bad Batch ever since it started, to be honest. But this season has kicked it up a notch. Uh, this episode is very short, mm. by the way, which kind of sucks. But yeah, it's a bit unfortunate. You know, I think it's like twenty-two minutes. That's including credits and stuff. So this uh, yeah, is like probably, probably like, like twenty minutes. If yeah, that, not even around there. <laughs> so we'll uh, we'll see what happens. Omega is now with the Empire, and we'll probably see. We'll, we'll probably see her on Tantus in this one, I would assume. But I do, yeah. like I said at the end of the last one, I really hope this picks up literally like right after what we just saw in the last one because yeah, I want no to see jumps. like Hunter's reaction to it. I want to see that interaction between him and Crosshair. So yeah, hopefully exactly. that's what we get. Um, So we'll uh get right in this uh, reaction review and we'll talk about it. Right after. Yeah, I really didn't have anything to say when I was, in, I was kind of rambling there for a minute. Yeah, I mean, it's fine. It's like, I mean, I keep saying the same thing. Like, this shit's gas, so. <laughs> I can't argue against it. <laughs> it's not like I'm going to disagree with you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I didn't do it that time. A <laughs> bit of a different... Uh... Dude, this music. Here we go on Tantus. I can't get over how good this show looks. It's insane. Ah, <laughs> oh, there he is. See ya, Tech. <laughs> See ya, maybe Tech. <laughs> maybe Tech. <laughs> this is gonna be a cool interaction. Yeah. Do this. I'm sorry, but I do. For what it's worth, I'm glad you're safe. Am I? She doesn't know. Who knows? Yeah. I didn't say I know. There's someone who might have. Who? Admiral Rampart. He sent Nalase there when we decommissioned to conquer city. Mm. Why didn't you say anything Ooh. before? Because Tantus isn't the place I ever wanted to go back to. And Rampart's not particularly trustworthy. Do not shoot! I <laughs> <laughs> you must be Crosshair. Tech told me all about your sparkling personality. Is that a no? <laughs> Any friend of Ionize is a friend of mine. Hey, let's go. This is from the trailer as well. Them being in this tank. I remember that. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I do remember that too. 
But I mean, uh, that I think that mm-hmm. would be officially the the last thing shown in the trailer. I'm, I hope so. Don't you order me around? You're the one <laughs> slowing us down. <laughs> wow. Rampart, Rampart looks, looks crazy, dude. He looks horrible. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like he's aged <laughs> yeah. 300 years. I expect you to know a stealth approach when you see it. <laughs> Does he just free falls? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Essentially. You see? Did you see Hunter's helmet floating? <laughs> there it is. I, 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 I see it. <laughs> That's a pretty crazy approach, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> it's been a minute since, we, since we've seen like a mission with all three of them. Yeah, it has been. Like all three of them together, too. Yeah, yeah. Quiet as usual. Hopefully, next assignment we'll see some action. Oh, that's uh. <laughs> that was Steve Blum doing that voice. <laughs> the dude that does Zeb. That's awesome. But hopefully we'll see some action. It's <laughs> stunned right away. This is completely random, but Crosshair might have like a top five clone trooper helmet. Oh, easily. <laughs> I've always thought it was cool. Yeah. Tex was really cool as well. Mm-hmm. Dude, some of these shots don't even look like animation. Oh yeah. Insane. Yep. <laughs> yep. Yep. Wrecker, remember Plan Fifty Five? Oh, yeah. Fifty Five. Wait, don't you? Go. <laughs> you had to think about it for a second. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, Ooh, let's go. What is this? Are you here to kill me? Tempting, but now. <laughs> <laughs> what about them? Just let him off. Yep. Shout out. <laughs> yep. Hey, you couldn't at least take their handcuffs off? That's true. I mean, <laughs> come on. They're running around with hand- What are they going to do? This is not the way that I would have thought that they'd get the coordinates. Not at all. I completely forgot about Rampart. Jeez. Holy crap. Oh, snap. Dude, what? (laughs) What? Oh, they're too smart. There you go. Are, are they? Holy oh my crap. god! <laughs> Dude, that's insane. Oh, no. oh. oh, let's try. Oh, please, you're not going to kill me. Not yet. Dude, they are just there. <laughs> <laughs> Not even s- slowing them down. Oh. <laughs> oh. That's, a, that's one way to get rid of some. Oh, he's gonna get crushed. Oh, <gasps> oh my god. There we go. Exactly <laughs> Bro, they are just chucking his body. <laughs> That's so funny. I bet Wrecker just throws him. He does. He got to, right? <laughs> I didn't think he was going to die, but I mean, you got to you got to be scared for at least a second there. You just never This is the final season. 
Yeah. You never know. It's more complicated than that. Complicated how? No one knows the coordinates to Tantus. Oh, no. No need for threats. After all, we're in this together. I'd never know. Of, of course. Years, but... <laughs> <laughs> I'll show you. I think I put her in the vault now. Yeah. Emery knows she shouldn't have done that. You are a vital piece to our work here, Omega. Who are they? They are the rest of the puzzle. This is your new home. And it ends there, of course. There it is with that eerie music again, dude. Uh-huh. Every Man. time. <sighs> dude, I... And Hemlock is... I keep talking about it, but dude, he is just... He's becoming one of, like, the be one of the best villains in Star Wars, I feel like. Well, because he's he, actually, like, a he's, villain. He's so evil, it's disgusting. <laughs> yeah. like, he, like you said before, he, the only person who might be more evil than him is Palpatine. But even then, yeah. it's like... I mean, dude, he, Hemlock's up there with him. It's just like people do... Like, like once you bring science into the mix, <laughs> that's when you really start getting messed up. Yeah. And... It makes me think of, like, real life things uh but yeah no I, I i enjoyed this episode it's definitely one of the i'm not gonna say filler because it's not filler because <laughs> it actually it still progresses the story it's yeah, just yeah. not as vital as exactly other things yeah it's pretty important we're... that they get rampart so you can't that... say it's not important but <laughs> exactly yeah at this point we're just kind of like i can feel it now we're we're building up to that finale where I can feel it now. Yeah, Everything I mean, three that's episodes. Happen. Yeah, we're we're leading up to something big here. Uh, you I gotta think, ready. Emery is really gonna play a part in, like Omega getting out and like this whole, this whole thing happening. Oh, hundred percent. Hundred. I'm. I'm very curious if this season is going to end with like every like they get all the clones off of Tantus and everything or it's that and also like Hemlock doesn't make it and stuff like that and like yeah because I, I feel like Palpatine's research was never com like fully complete. It didn't seem like. Yeah, no, nah, it was like it definitely wasn't perfected. That's for sure. Because in Episode Nine, he's like basic. I mean, he's basically dead. It's yeah, a it... zombified <laughs> version of himself. Yeah, like you could definitely tell it wasn't perfected. Obviously. Um, so I definitely think it definitely feels like they got close to perfecting it, but you know, I, you know, maybe we'll see here in this, you know, with the last three episodes, maybe we'll see that progress in that project, and then mm -hmm. maybe that's kind of where they left off. I don't really know, but obviously we'll see. Yeah, because I'm, I'm not, I'm not sure if they're gonna keep Hemlock around. Like I, I have a feeling that he might, he might like get double crossed by Emery or something. Because I yeah, feel like Emery it, is going to be an important piece in, in this escape. Yeah, yeah. and then at that point, it's like, you know, if he loses Omega again, and then also, you know, Emery turns on him, and, you know, the whole base just, you know, there's chaos around, like, Palpatine's not going to, Palpatine's going to 
if he lives through it or not, like Palpatine's going to deal with Hemlock, I'm sure. Yeah, um, and then I mean, also Tarkin when they talked, Tarkin, he was saying yeah. like if this if this doesn't go how it's supposed to, like you're you're not going to want that to happen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. So it it's definitely se- seeming like it's going to go down that route where Hemlock's the end result for Hemlock is not going to be good. That's for sure. No. <laughs> Um. Oh my God. I. Uh, I'm like so. <laughs> you know how the other the other episode, where we first got shown the vault, and the, yeah. the specimens yeah. in it, and how depressing mm-hmm. that that episode was. That was brutal. I have a feeling the next three are probably gonna be to that level of depressing. <laughs> I mean, they probably will be. Because <laughs> we're gonna see more of the vault. We're gonna see Omega interacting with the other kids. Yeah. Someone's probably going to die. <laughs> <laughs> no, the, the finale is going to be so brutal. It's going to be so brutal. It really is. It really I'm, is. I'm assuming that... So the finale is called The Cavalry Has Arrived, which is like the first line that the Bad Batch even has. No, that's... Um, man, that's just... So I'm assuming that's when they actually get to Tantus. Yeah, and they storm the... And who knows they... how many people are going to be with them because they're probably going to have help from Rex and Echo. Oh, yeah, guaranteed. Uh, and whoever else they can get. So... You think they get help from Saw Gerrera? No way. I mean, after what happened last time, I don't know. I, You know, I don't know. Because I feel I've what we what we heard from him uh, on Iriadu in the season finale, like he he just wants to hurt the empire, not necessarily like save anyone, you know. Yeah, I mean, they could, maybe they could spin it to him like that, like because technically he is hurting the empire if he attacks that base. Yeah, but you know, you might get another situation like what happened last time with Tech, and then him just blowing it up and not really caring about anybody else. You know what I mean? So. Mm-hmm. So probably not, but I just I brought mean, it I'm... up just because they have like he's he's been in both seasons up to this point. Yeah, uh, for sure. So they might have some sort of connection, but I don't know. It the cavalry has arrived just makes me think that it's going to be a lot of people I mean, it's showing up be. to help them. If you, I mean all this build up to storm this base that's literally like impossible to find essentially. Yeah. Like it's gotta be like you gotta have a crazy amount of people storming this base because it and the and like you got so many commandos uh mm-hmm. on Tantus. There's so many of them. I mean, just walking into the vault, there's like ten of them at least just standing there watching it. Yeah, just watching the entrance to the vault. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no matter then there's a bunch more on the base. There's you know, Scorch is there. Mm-hmm. Um I mean there, there's so many like people there all, all these assassin clones that oh, they have uh, yeah like maybe tech and all the other assassin clones like dude it's <laughs> i mean it's insane they're gonna have to bring a whole art like a cavalry essentially yeah that that's another thing that i think we're gonna find out probably within the next two episodes i think we would find out before the the finale of like what's going on with these assassin clones because i still think that like it is entirely possible that they have tech tech's body and they're you like just using his dna to be able to make yeah. these clones and then probably used dna from crosshair mm-hmm. to make because they're crazy snipers True. so they're probably just mixing crosshair and tech uh and obviously if they had hunter and record they would do the same there but Oh yeah, for sure. I'm, I'm, I have a feeling that's that's what they're probably doing. But I think we're gonna find that out in the next couple episodes. I'm hoping so. That's my like one of the biggest question marks is like what's, you know, like what's going on with this whole like as you know project essentially. Yeah. Like what's the end goal of this project? I guess. Ah, <sighs> all right. Well, that was episode twelve. I'm very, I'm terrified, man. <laughs> I can't believe we're I can't believe we're this far in, dude. It's insane. Three more episodes. It's actually kind of like depressing. 
Because I, I'm, I, dude, this, this show is so good. It's so good. I don't think we'll have another show ever like this, to be honest. Probably not. Probably not. When's what's the next show that's coming out? Is it that? The Acolyte. Uh, it's it the Acolyte. Okay. Yeah. Which is, I mean, I have no expectations for that. I don't. I think I have a feeling that's not going to be similar to really any of the shows that we have. Yeah, for sure. Got to keep my expectations in check for that one. Yeah. But uh, some good right. stuff to look forward to. Yeah. Well, that'll be it for this reaction review. Let us know what you guys thought of this episode. And we will catch you next week for hopefully not a depressing episode, but it probably will be. Okay, goodbye.